Common dog to the 17 is a full spectrum bilateral exercise between the Philippine military and the U.S. military, and down here at the Coast Guard Department and conducting DBSS operations. Specifically, my team is the one that is uh, providing the course of instruction and evaluating on the runs on the buses. Myself, uh, I help design the courses of instruction that we're giving. The objectives for this specific training, VBSS, Visit Board Search and Seizure, where we're actually describing the full meal process here the interdiction operations into VBSS. Uh, we started out with the introduction to maritime interdiction operations, ship familiarization, moving into tactics for cleaning the boats uh, from everything from the beginning of getting off of where you're going, boarding the boat, properly clear it, control it, process detainees, search the vessel properly, uh, and know how to turn it over and get off boat safely back to their, their own vessel without any serious uh, injuries being sustained in themselves and if there are injuries, how do they handle those injuries if they need to, which is all part of the system we've been giving. So far I think they're doing really well. The difference between now and just doing the halfway period of the training is uh, drastic. Uh, lots of improvement. So far it's been nothing but absolutely pleasant. We're getting a lot of uh, support from the Coast Guard here, everything that we needed to conduct the training, uh, the support from the vessels, letting us run around all day. We're still talking about the region where you have going on down in Minnesota right now. I think it's important that uh, all the countries that are working together in the region be on the same page, be sharing tactics, sharing ideas. It's going to make uh, operations down the road easier if we can all work together and be on the same sheet of music. Continue to practice what we've been running. It's a very perishable skill. You let it go weeks, months without doing runs, uh, practicing your tactics, you're going to forget. In case a mission does come up where you are in a place where you need to board a vessel, you need to be ready to go. So continue to work with your team, continue to practice your tactics. Do four runs, set yourself up to do a full mission, a practice mission. Keep yourself uh, sharp and ready for what could possibly come out of Indeed, I am very pleased to inform everyone that we are fortunate having the opportunity to participate in this very noble undertaking. I am pretty sure that participants have earned the much needed confidence and common understanding on the vessel board and search as well as becoming effective agents on law enforcement, relief capabilities and other humanitarian and civil assistance operations. On this note, let me congratulate all the participants and instructors for the job well done. I hope that you will apply all the knowledge, skills and best practices that you have gained in this exercise in the actual performance of your time on our duties to protect our country and people. To our uh, good counterparts in the Philippine Navy, the Philippine Marine Corps, Please allow me to emphasize that the Philippine Coast Guard will be gladly welcoming more friendly visits, cooperation, and exercising like exercises like this. We will be your credible and reliable partners in addressing our common concern, the maritime security challenges in our country. Once again, congratulations to everyone. We are looking forward to more activities of this kind to further strengthen our fund of friendship as maritime law enforcers and partners in maritime security of our country. Thank you and Mabuhay Nagat.